A symbolic host city, Warsaw will see NATO's first summit to be held in Poland, and it's being described as the most important since the end of the Cold War. It's taken on even more significance in the aftermath of Brexit, with the alliance hoping to make a show of Western unity. On the streets, people are aware of the summit's seriousness. This man says it's an important meeting. The leaders have to decide how to improve the defense of Poland and eastern borders of Europe. Another local resident says there is a great threat coming from Putin. What happened to Ukraine may also happen to Poland. After Russia annexed Crimea from Ukraine in 2014 and the ensuing conflict in the east of the country, Moscow has been conducting military exercises on Europe's eastern fringes. The transatlantic alliance is expected to sign off on a new force in the Baltic, aimed at promoting peace by deterring Moscow, as this analyst explains. We expect that NATO will decide to increase presence of forces on its eastern flank, and that the clear expectations are of about 4,000 troops rotating through the Baltic states and Poland, but on persistent basis. The Kremlin says that NATO is the aggressor by moving forces onto former Soviet territory, which it considers within its sphere of influence. Our reporter points to the historical significance of Warsaw in East-West relations. He sums up saying on the agenda of the summit are measures not only of deterrence but also of collective defence. A Moscow envoy has already described them as a threat to peace in Europe.